rocks and minerals. Our planet Earth is almost entirely made up of rocks. Hills, mountains and valleys are made of rocks. Stones and pebbles are made of rocks. Even the garden soil and sand are made up of many tiny particles of rock. Rocks are found under the soil and at the bottom of rivers and seas. Now, let us look at the different types of rocks. Some rocks are hard, some are soft, while some are shiny. They are of different colors too. They may be grey, black, red and white in color. If a rock is tightly pressed and heated for a few million years, it can turn into a new kind of rock. For example, sandstone becomes quartzite, shale becomes slate and limestone becomes marble. Now let us have a look at a few rocks and their different uses. Marble It is a hard rock. It is used in our homes for flooring. It is also used for making statues, buildings and furniture. It comes in different colors. Taj Mahal is made up of white marble. Granite It is a very hard rock. It shines and looks attractive when polished. Large slabs of granite are used for floors. It is also used for making kitchen and bathroom platforms. Sandstone It is also a hard rock but not as hard as marble or granite. It is used in construction. Our very own red port in Delhi is entirely made of red sandstone. Slate It is a soft grey rock. Some houses have roofs made of slate. Blackboards and slates used for writing are also made of slate. Chalk It is a soft rock. It is used by a teacher to write on the blackboard. Lastly, charcoal. It is also a soft rock. It is used as fuel in engines and for cooking in villages. Now, let us see what these rocks are made up of. All rocks are made up of minerals. Most rocks are made up of two or more minerals. Minerals Now, let us learn more about minerals. Minerals are not easily available. We need to extract them from the rocks before we can use them. We use minerals in our daily lives. Minerals come in different colors and shapes. Now, let us look at a few minerals, their properties and uses. Iron It is commonly found and hard. It is used to make tools and nails. Quartz It is commonly found and hard. It is in crystal form. It is found in different colors. Different gemstones are made from it. It is also used in watches. Talc It is the softest mineral 
and there are no crystals in it. It is used to make talcum powder. Silica It is hard and commonly found in nature as sand or quartz. It is used to make mirrors and glasses. Salt It is very important and a basic necessity. It adds taste to the food. Tungsten It is hard. It is used in light bulbs and tube lights. The glowing filament in them is tungsten. Clay or China clay It is soft. It is used to make pottery and decorative plates. Graphite It is soft and grey in colour. The lead of pencils is made of graphite. Lastly, gemstones. Gemstones are very hard minerals. They are also called precious and semi-precious stones. These stones are very expensive. Some gemstones have a very peculiar color. These stones are cut into different shapes and sizes and are polished before using in jewelry. Now we know that rocks and minerals help us in our day-to-day -day life. Hence, it is important to use the mineral resources wisely.